Oh! Hey everyone, Henry Hello here. I'm getting ready to watch Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio. I hope I said his name right. Now, the only Pinocchio I remember watching was Disney's Pinocchio when I was very, very young. I can barely remember the movie now. Uh, what I do remember is Pinocchio got alived by a fairy. He went on a puppet show, he made friends, drank beer, turned into a donkey, got eaten by a whale, got vomited by the whale, and I think it should have had a happy ending. I think. Today's Pinocchio is a stop motion animation. Now the only stop motion animation movie I remember watching, uh, the last one was probably Kubo and the Two Strings. Now that was a good movie. Now, do you know any other good, you know, stop motion animation movies? Do let me know in the comments so I can add it to my movies list so I can do a movie react on it in the future. And I usually post my reacts every week, so remember to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you can enjoy more movie reacts together. Um, this Pinocchio, I read a little bit about it. Apparently it is um, a little bit of a musical tale, but it's also a little bit of dark fantasy in it. Not sure how dark it'll get. I guess we'll see. So let's jump right into Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio. Okay, that's a pine cone. By the time Master Geppetto made Pinocchio, oh, Geppetto. he had already lost a son. Oh. Oh, the details of his beard. They've been together been only born. 10 years. Oh, he was only 10 years old. <laughs> well, it's been a while since I watched stop motion, huh? Not really used to it. This was during the... some war? They wanted for nothing. All they needed was each other's company. Spies are found out immediately because they are like long noses, visible to all but the teller of the lie. I'm sure you'll be able to see if your nose grows longer. I mean, I can see my nose right now. It's always visible to us. And if you looked at me today, my heart would heal. Oh, so he was making a piggy and people chasing it with butcher knives. Oh, it was for the butcher. That's a tree like a dog. In the morning and the evening too. Hmm, looks like a very simple, peaceful life. When one life is lost, another must grow. This one's missing some of his scales. Oh, what does he want to make? You can make something out of pine cones? My son. He's gonna carve a whole shoe? Oh, that looks pretty nice. Yeah, but I probably need socks to wear that. Or else it might hurt your feet. Good night, Papa. Good night, my son. I love my new shoes, Papa! They look good. Hello there, little dog. The dog now has the four feet made of wood. Oh, it could be a different dog. <laughs> Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Buongiorno is good morning, right? Send up a little more red for me, Carlo. Oh, he's such a good boy, helping his father all the way. I forgot to show you what I found. What is it, my boy? Good pine cone. <laughs> the perfect pine cone. I thought I could plant it myself and watch the tree grow. I don't think I've ever seen a real pine cone in real life. No, are they having an earthquake? Do they have earthquakes in Italy? Oh, wait, my pine cone! Oh no, it's the war! It was later said that Geppetto's little town was not even a target. No, they're gonna they nuke the church. They simply let go of their bombs to make their ballast light. In a place where there might be a population, are you serious? Oh no. Poor Carlo, he didn't even know what hit him. No. Carlo was Capetto's everything. In war, there's plenty of collateral damage. He worked very little, he ate even less, and the church's crucifix remained unfinished. Oh, it seems to be in pretty good condition, the crucifix. The world moved on. Oh, pinecone grew. But Geppetto did not. Well, how many years does it take for it to grow that big? Decades. 
And this is where I come in. Who are you? He even has a beard. Ah, oh, sorry, a mustache. No, is he a cricket? I found it. Home. Ah. I had wow. By Sebastian J. Cricket. Cricket. J stands for Jiminy. Jiminy Cricket. I dream you were right back here with me. Oh, he's drowning himself with alcohol. His wife is dead and he lost his son. What is that? I've learned that there are old spirits living in the mountains, in the forests. Is that an eye? Ah, yes. Peru. What a my antenna! He's chopping a tree down. Whoa, this is starting to become a nightmare for the cricket. Sebastian. Let's just call him Sebastian. Sebastian J. Cricket. Yo, get out of there, Sebastian. There we go. Oh! oh, oh. For you, yes. Almost got his head smashed in. I mean, I'm sure he's creating something beautiful. Dude, the cricket looks like a nightmare. Hmm. That was a very long nose. All he's missing is a heart. Oh. Bugger off. <laughs> Bugger off. This is my home. No trespass. Go, 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 go. He still wants to make it his home. Yes, that's right. Wow. That's a higher level of whatever that is. I suppose it. Angel, I guess. Excuse me, can I help you? This is my home we're talking about. Who on earth are you? Oh, he's brave. On earth, a guardian guide him to be good. In this world, you get what you give. Take on this responsibility, and I will grant you one wish. Wow. Anything. Anything. Hmm. I'll try my best, and that's the best anyone can do. Let me take care of Pinocchio. I can take care of him. <laughs> Get me that wish. So she gave Pinocchio a heart, or will there always be a hole there where the where Sebastian stays? Geppetto, your wish came true. You now have a foster son. Ouch. It's very scary when you're living alone. Don't chop Pinocchio. He's made of wood. Whoa, okay now. It's starting to make it look like a horror movie. Good morning, Papa! You wanted me to live. My name is Pinocchio. I'm your son! Don't come near me! The boy's telling the truth, Master Geppetto! Ah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, 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 no. You nearly killed yourself. Okay, so Geppetto can hear the cricket talk. Wow! Yeah. All the things my eyes can see. Uh, so. He's destroying everything. That's why he needs Sebastian as a conscience. Oh, whoa, whoa. I just thought about it, Pinocchio is immortal. Doesn't need food, doesn't need a piss or poop, doesn't need water. I'm sorry. Just stay here. Don't come up. Stop! You must obey your papa. But I don't want to obey. You must try your best, and that's the best anybody can do. My dear father. No! <laughs> that was so sudden. Oh! In real life, he would have been dead already. I mean, it's amazing that Pinocchio already knows English. I wonder how everybody will react. They'll probably say, DEMON! Papa! Someone said Diablo, which means... <laughs> Satan? It's a demon! I knew it. Malocchio! I don't know what's Malocchio. Who controls you, wooden boy? Magic. Who controls you? Oh. Oh. Ah. 
No one talks to the Podesta like that. Podesta. I'm a real boy. Ooh, here's a very interesting look on how children copies their parents. So at first, the kid is probably thinking, whoa, that's cool, his nose just grew longer. But then he checks for his father's reaction, which is probably disgust or fear, and he copies his father. In most cases, children are a reflection of their parents' upbringing. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> he has a tongue. He's in a tiny violin. Why did my nose grow today? You lied. The more you lie, the more it grows. Yes, that's it. Candlewick, go sit by the fire. His name is Candlewick. The community was startled by your... It's a miracle. You've never eaten anything in your life. Oh, I'm starving, Papa. I'm starving to death. Is he just being dramatic? Go, go warm your feet by the fire. He's gonna burn himself. Have my word. So what about oh. this wooden boy? <laughs> but he seems strong, sturdy, made of good Italian pine. That's, that's a compliment. Oh no, he's gonna burn him. Closer to the fire to get warm. His head can go 360. His teeth, perfect teeth. No sign of jaundice. Look. Oh yeah, he doesn't feel pain. <laughs> Just throw him outside in the rain. You ruined the nice light on my feet. Oh, his feet is gone. Wait, when he drank the hot chocolate, where did it go? He's gonna make him new feet, right? And I light them on fire. <laughs> if you go to sleep. He doesn't even need sleep. Good night, Papa. Good night, my good night. He still doesn't acknowledge Pinocchio as his son yet. Who's Carlo? Geppetto lost him many years ago. How can you lose a whole <laughs> person? It's a great burden for a father to lose a child so young. He doesn't yet understand death. Painful you must carry, even though it hurts you very much. I'd freak out if I see a cricket crawl, crawl right into my chest. I couldn't do it before! What is that? A monkey. <laughs> How smart is the monkey? He can set up the poster. Oh, look at his hair. A living puppet? Whoa, he can understand monkeys. Oh, using sign language. Okay, that monkey is a genius. What are they doing? Yeah, that's, that musical was okay, I guess. Not really my thing. He's made of wood too. Why do they like him and not me? Kind of hard to explain. Da -da. What does it do? I love it, I love it! What is it? He doesn't know how to read yet. Belonged to a very special boy. And you loved him very much? I do. Then I will be just oh. like Carlo. Yeah, this Pinocchio is gonna try. He exists. I must have him. That'll be kidnapping. Although it's debatable if he's considered a kid. What's the multiplication table? Say you have four cards, 27 apples. I have no apples and I refuse to lie. Oh, what? I don't think I like school anymore, Sebastian. Well, his interests waned really fast. Ah! Even now, book learning cannot compare to witness. Oh my god, Sebastian's life is in danger. All the hot chocolate you can drink and all the games you can play. What a scam. One last detail to take care of. Oh, oh now you're gonna make him sign a contract. Don't. Ah! Oh. No. Like this? That's not even a signature. Oh, ah. the pain. Oh, Life. look at him. You're such hideous pain. <laughs> Life is suffering. Oh, he spilled it on his shoes. Your boy didn't show up at school today. You better look for him. Boy, the carnival sure is grand. What is he drinking? Did he just drink paint? <laughs> what? The monkey can actually talk. You are a wonder, a miracle. They love you. You just spun the string and tangled them up. 
Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Ah! <laughs> you already taught Pinocchio so fast. For ice cream and for pie. Wow, they, they did a whole choreography in such a short time. Carlo's oh. book. He ruined the book. But the cricket's Over still there. there. Oh. oh! He's... Oh my god, poor Sebastian. What's all this? They love me, they accept me! How do you know that so anyway? Bandits came out of the bushes and took... You shouldn't lie to me. I am your papa. How far can it grow? I am not lying! Oh, it's a pine tree. He's not your puppet. He's mine. Oh no. Is he going to be thrown on the truck? Never! He's going to break. Oh, he's going to get run over by a truck. That's what happens when you let your children run wild. Oh, it's him. Pinocchio was dead. How? No, I don't understand. How How could he die? Isn't he mortal? What are they? That part of dead, don't you understand? Is he in the underworld? Go see the boss, kid. Through there. Okay, this is new. But they brought the whole body to the underworld. Oh, this is the movie poster. Is he gonna meet a Sphinx? Who are you? The wooden boy with the borrowed soul. Borrowed soul. You cannot truly, truly die. I knew it is immortal. The one thing that makes human life precious and meaningful is how brief it is. Okay. You will stay here with me a little longer each time you cross. After that sand runs out, we'll go back. Ah! See you next time. Interesting concept. Not. <laughs> what is the doctor doing? Like, <laughs> what are you checking for? A pulse? He's wood. I'm afraid the body is rigid. Yeah, no, no obviously. <laughs> Somebody's, somebody makes sense. A dead body? Huh? Where? He's alive! You're alive! He is immortal! Yeah. It's a miracle. Oh, now it's a miracle. I have a legally binding contract. It's not even a signature. It's just a smiling sun! I drew that! <laughs> oh, no. Our country comes first. Send him into the war? I knew it! You will learn to fight and fire a weapon. He can be the ultimate assassin, ultimate soldier, but if his body is blown to bits, it's no use. War is not good. War took Carlo away from me. Why can't you be more like Carlo? Because I'm not Carlo. He's not. He can't be. Carlo's dead. You are such a burden. Hmm, that hurts his wooden feelings. I mean, he's an innocent, oblivious nose soul. Didn't grow. Their nose won't grow. I don't want to be a burden. Sometimes fathers feel despair, and they say things, but with time, they learn that, well, that they never really meant it at all. I'm going to the carnival. That way, I can help Papa, and I won't go to war. Oh, that's... <gasps> no! No! Wow, what trickery. He's learned how to deceive. Tell him I love him, and I won't be a burden anymore. Go on, Sebastian, you can do it. If I work for you, will you forget the money you want from my papa? Absolutely, my dear boy. Will you send him my share of the profits? I don't believe him. I don't believe him. Come on, Sebastian. I'm really rooting for him, you know. Don't tell me he's under the mallet. Oh, well, that was close. Oh. Oh, the pain. So, is, is he a comic relief? Why do you want to see a cricket in pain? Son. He called him son. Just one. Oh, uh, he's gone to the carnival. Oh. And the carnival's gone. Oh, now you want to find him after you called him a burden. Why are you so blind? The boy loves you. Would it kill you to do as much for him? Where are you going? After my son. Nobody listens to Sebastian. Why? Farewell, my papa. 
mean, it seems like he's doing well. How did he create these posters? I mean, it's probably not printed out, right? Is it drawn? The monkey's getting fed up. Oh, Candlewick is going to train as a soldier. I think Pinocchio might meet Candlewick again. You see how performances really are like, he's, he's so tired backstage, but you gotta be happy and bright during the performance. Viva! Viva! See, Pinocchio is really so tired. One last stop. Oh, he could have met him. Share the money back home to Papa. He isn't doing anything. Minus expenses, transportation, and promotions. I knew it. Form for His Excellency Il Duce. Il Duce? He and I are very close. That's him back there. <laughs> so proud. Proud. Ah, he's just making use of you, Pinocchio. That's not the sea out there. Here's a hook. Captain Hook and a... Uh, what is it called? Stilt? The dogfish, risen from the icy depths. The monster, the size of 20 ships! The whale. What's your name, Captain Ahab? This is all I have in the world. I just want to see him again. Can I take a moment to rest? I mean, technically Pinocchio doesn't need rest, right? Count Volpe is using you. He hasn't sent a penny. To your father. Spazzatura is his favorite. He's always been. <laughs> Tooting his own horn. You're all just jealous. He still doesn't know that those puppets are controlled by the monkey, Spazzatura. Is that gonna. Full oh, bird! He's navigating waters full of mines. My dear father, love to say. <laughs> the captain just said, I'm out of there. Yo, give the cricket a chance to sing. Oh, that's huge. Nobody wanted you, and I saved you. Stop that! Don't hurt him anymore. Oh. I won't have my co star treated this way. Oh, his co star. I think you misunderstand our relationship. I am the master, you are the slave. Mm. You have nothing to worry about. <laughs> Easy for you to- <laughs> He's using him as paint! <laughs> Are you kidding me? I'm having dinner tonight! He used the cricket as paint. <laughs> and he's like, we're so lucky to be trapped in a monster's stomach. I don't get it. Are they trying to make a parody or something? Hmm? I got some real good ideas. So Pinocchio's gotten smarter. Oh, we'll give him a show he will never forget. Hmm, what does he have in mind? Baby poops his pants right there in front of me. Shoot him and burn it all down. Oh no. I cannot die. <laughs> we know. <laughs> They're like, yeah, it's him again. But what if his body gets burned? I could get killed a lot. I'm the luckiest boy in the world. Uh. Eternal life can bring eternal suffering. Mm-hmm. Yep. While you may have eternal life, your loved ones, they do not. Yeah. That's why I never want immortality. I don't care for it. I knew it! You came back to life. Oh, now he's a soldier. You'll return home a hero. Any father would be proud of such a son. Hmm. I don't know though, if someone burns Pinocchio to ashes, will he come back? It's possible because he supposedly got shot but there's no bullet holes on him. So maybe his body will be restored. Oh, this actually looks a little bit like a fun obstacle. Anyone here afraid of the enemy? Uh-huh. No, no, sir! Mm -mm. My papa said war is bad. My father says if you're right to die for your country, you're weak. Hmm. I'll show him I'm no coward. 
I'll make him like me. <sighs> when they say things, they only think they mean in the moment. But with time, they learn that they never really meant it at all. So he did listen to Cricket. But inside, they love you. Let's hope that's true for Candlewick's case. Are you scared of dying? Me? You're asking him. I'm glad you're here. <sighs> Me too. Well, at least they found a friend in him. The first team to place their flag at the top of the tower wins. Yeah, they're on different teams. Rifles are loaded with paint and grenades confetti. So like paintball. They never taught them how to shoot yet. Oh, headshot. Watch out. Confetti grenades. Could be a pretty fun game. They're gonna put both flags together. <laughs> I don't think his father will like that though. We both won, father! Oh, is that so? Candlewick. Oh, the echo. I mean, Pinocchio won't actually die. I told you to shoot the puppet! No! Yo, don't point the gun at your father. Just trying to please you, but I never will. Flimsy. Just like the wick of a candle. That's why it's called candle wick. I can say no to you. I can do that. You are no son of mine! <sighs> <sighs> oh, he's, he's even bleeding. <laughs> oh, well, they're all gonna die. How did Pinocchio fly? Out of there. Wait, that means Candlewick's dead. No, he's not. But his father's dead. I can't believe he found him. I found you at last. Yeah, that was a question I had on my mind. If he's burned, then how? Bazatura! Please help me! <laughs> Give me that! <laughs> Is our contract worth nothing? No. Burn bright! Like a star! How could you do this to me? And for a puppet! The puppet has more morals than you. Break your chains, Spazatura. Uh oh. Oh ho, that bit his nose. Oh no. Oh! Spazatura might have survived, but that guy hit the rock. Yeah, Spazatura survived. I feel like it's a very nice scene for the monster to come up and eat them while swallowing the seagull. Look! An island! That's not an island. That's the monster! How does that thing not die from the mines? Oh, nicely animated. Bubbles and underwater scene. Mmm, gastric juices. Don't eat that. I feel like he's gonna eat that. Do not eat that, please. <laughs> Would've been disgusting. <laughs> Pinocchio! Like, I'm surprised they even have oxygen in here. He comes seeking the warmth of the sun every decade or so. Decade? It will drag us with him. Oh my god! This is it! Okay. Well, convenient that he just discovered this right now. The lighthouse actually still working after being swallowed. How did they escape in the Disney movie? He's gonna lie. His, his nose can grow indefinitely. Just grow a pine tree. I love water. <laughs> I wanna be trapped here forever and ever and ever. Imagine it says, I'm wearing a girl's panties and it didn't grow. <laughs> like in Shrek, Pinocchio. <laughs> How's Pinocchio gonna get there though? Man, what is this thing? 
Oh, okay. If they escape, they're gonna be in the middle of the ocean. They could get eaten again after they escape. Uh oh. Should have grown it longer. I got you, son. Oh no. The air is that powerful. Imagine landing on a mine and then blammo. Oh Pinocchio, do not swim towards that mine. Oh no, don't 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 He's gonna get blown to bits, isn't he? He's just gonna get swallowed up again. It's gonna explode. Yeah, that thing is big. Looks kinda like one of those Lohan fishes, you know, the one with a big bulb on the forehead. Oh, this time it's on the teeth. Come on, Spassador, you can do it! <laughs> that tail became a became a rotor engine. So he knows how mines work. Hit it. Hello, darkness, my old friend. He completely missed. <laughs> He's swimming against the waves. Are you kidding me? Oh, that was enough to kill the monster. Interesting, the monster was smart enough to avoid all the mines. Send me back now, please! If you were to go back now, it will be your last life. I don't care! So he'll give up his immortality. Break the rules. Break them. Go to your father, child, and make the most of it. They'll never meet again. Where's Pesatura? And where's Sebastian? Good thing Pinocchio doesn't need to breathe. Oh no. Pinocchio, I hope you know how to do CPR. Well, Cricket got lucky. I can't believe it! Oh, his father's alive. I thought he had drowned. Wake up, Pinocchio. He can't be dead. He can't drown! But he shouldn't be able to drown. I need you! <laughs> and now you learn to appreciate him. Hmm? I'm still in denial. I don't think he's dead. Because I don't believe he can drown. You get what you give, remember? And this boy gave his boy life. gave everything he could! Pinocchio did die. And make Pinocchio a good boy! You would concede me one wish! Yes, one wish. And did you accomplish this task? I'd say yes. I tried my best, and that's the best anyone can do. Pinocchio taught me that. You taught Pinocchio that. Yeah. I wish him back to life. Hmm. I was trying to make you someone you were not. I love you exactly as you are. Hmm. Oh, we got a happy ending. In Disney's Pinocchio, did he become a real boy? I think he became a real boy. So in this one, he remains an immortal wooden boy. Life is such a wonderful gift. <laughs> the cricket sacrificed his wish to bring Pinocchio back. Geppetto aged. Pinocchio didn't. Yeah. I wasn't moving anymore, so he put me in a matchbox. How are you writing the story? Hey, that matchbox is the... It's got the picture of the... I don't know what they are. Ghost bunnies? Oh, even Spazzatura died. I mean, of course, right? So Pinocchio is now wise and aged. What happens, happens. And oh. then... We are gone. It's the same as the intro. The intro showed a pine and the end of a pine. I was recounting my life! It was a good oh. life! So he's here now. And he's the same size as them. My dear father... I finally give him a chance to sing. Tears and mend your sorrows to... Our life has a funny way of going round and... Tomorrow's... Pinocchio can easily kill himself. He just needs to... Uh... Kill himself, go to the Sphinx, break the laws again, and come back on a last life. He could end it whenever he wants. 
So in the end, he accompanied the petals, Petatura and Sebastian to the end of their lives. And he wanders the earth, an immortal wooden puppet. He might have lived for centuries. I'm sure it's very different from uh, the Disney's Pinocchio because I think he became a real boy and that was the end of it. So they, they did a little bit of twist at the ending here. But in the middle, it's all almost the same. He went on a puppet show. He got swallowed by a sea monster. I think in the cartoon, it was a whale. And the only thing that's missing is he didn't become a donkey. Instead, he got replaced with being a soldier. So in the end, Candlewick's father died in the bombing. But hopefully, Candlewick survived because, I don't know, It's at the time, it seems like the bombing kept on going. I don't know if Candlewick survived or not. What's that guy's name? The guy with the, the circus owner. Okay, I just call him the circus owner. So the circus owner didn't make it. He splattered on a rock. Good riddance to him. Very interesting concept. Each time he dies, he goes to meet the Sphinx and he has to wait longer between each deaths. My question got answered actually because I thought if he got burned or if his body was destroyed, then like will he, when he comes back, will his body be restored? The answer is no. So that means after Gepetto died, he needs to be extra careful unless he can find a carpenter to help him build any missing limbs or feet. I mean, eventually Pinocchio, the wood will eventually rot, right? Unless it's varnished or whatever. This movie taught us a few lessons and one of them is just do your best because that's the best that anyone can do and be grateful for the things you already have. So when he had Pinocchio, yeah, it was a little, a little bit of effort and a burden to teach him how to be a boy, to teach him all the common sense of the world. It was only at the end that he was actually grateful to have had Pinocchio. Thankfully, it wasn't too late because Sebastian made the wish to bring Pinocchio back to life. So thankfully, there was that wish, which they set up at the beginning of the movie. I completely forgot about the wish, actually, until he mentioned it. You could say it's a touching movie. It just didn't really... I didn't get enough connection with the characters to feel like really really upset or sad when when you know they died i mean for pinocchio i was in denial because i was like no way he died he's made of wood he cannot drown and for Gepetto, Gepetto i guess it's it's just life Gepetto, Spasatura, sebastian to be able to die of old age maybe in your sleep is a great way to go do you know of any other great stop motion animation movies? Feel free to leave an answer in the comments so I can go check it out and maybe even watch it in my future movie reacts. So remember to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you know when my next movie react is coming out. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.